glare is so thick. These are just, hell, let's try these. No, these, those are not gonna work. We're just gonna go without the glasses. I'm Candy Johnson reporting live from the windiest place on earth. That was me, Candy Johnson, reporting live from inside this blow dryer. I will risk whatever it takes to bring you the beauty news. As you will notice, my hair is a different texture than it usually is. If you'd like to see a tutorial of this, please comment below. Later, the first shirt off my back giveaway, coming along with a little cosmetic something or other. Also, I'm going to be covering an ingredient that is in most cosmetics that you may not know is aging us. That's right, it's giving you premature wrinkles. I'm also going to be talking about some products that are going to be off the shelves in just a few weeks. Next, I'm going to be telling you my favorites, new things I've tested out and tried from drugstore brand to fancy products. So stay tuned as we go live to Candy Johnson in the newsroom. Candy? Thank you, Candy. We are back at the beauty desk to give you the latest in beauty news, including an app that you may want to get on your phone for some more beauty fun. As you know, I have to wear glasses because this makes me look like I'm smart, and um, pretty much that's it. But they're, they're not real. Now the first thing I want to tell you guys about is the order of urgency here. So the first product that's going to be not available to you I need to tell you guys about. And that is going to be some of the things from MAC, which I am kind of obsessed with. I've been obsessed with this lip color, which is Force of Love from the Chenmin Collection, which is only going to be available until April 5th. So hurry and buy like 20 of these lipsticks if you like this color. Or see if there's any left, because I want to buy them all. It looks similar to the Nicki Minaj one, but it's this is much more uh, wear. I don't know. I love it. I've been wearing it in every recent video, and people are like, what is that color? It's Force of Love from the Chenmin Collection. The other thing I've been obsessed with from the Chenmin Collection is the beauty powder in Play It Proper. Have you seen this? It's like a pink glow, and I'm going to just put some more on. And it's like a highlight, but the highlight powder is so light, it just gives you this gorgeous, it's like a really light pink cool color, and it is amazing. I, I just love it. I'm addicted. These are the two most awesome things I just want to buy more and more and more of. So, Force of Love and Play It Proper from the Chenmin Collection. These are amazing. Now, also that's going to be disappearing um, in April is going to be Shop and Cook Collection from um, MAC. Now, the cool thing about these is Tender Tones, and Tender Tones are like a really cool lip balm. Just look at this beautiful color. This is gorgeous. This is in Hush Hush. Um, they taste yummy. They're in these cute little glass containers. I like this Tread Gently one. It's like a yellow shimmery color. I don't know if you can see this really well. It smells so delicious, like just deliciousness. I love it. And if you put this on a nude lip, it'll like cancel out some of the redness and it's just beautiful. And then if you're like, eh, I don't really like nude colors, they have some really fun spicy colors. So this really pretty orangey one in purring. Look at how pretty this is, a really pretty orangey color. So these are on their way out the door, so you gotta hurry and get these. And then these are really cool. These are the kissable lip colors, and this is in Scandalicious. And then this one is in So Vain. It's more like a neutral color. And then this is my favorite, because I just like these cool pinky colors. This is in Enchante, this kissable color. And it's long lasting, it doesn't really come off. So these are really cool. This Enchante is my favorite one. And then they also had these little palettes that came with the collection too. So I'm just going to show you a few of them. I don't have them all. Um, this is Call Me Bubbles. This is like the quad with the four colors in it. And this is just like a warm, really pretty color. And then this is like some purple, some grays, a pink. This taupey, silvery purple color is gorgeous. This is Shop and Drop. This is called um, Color Added. And it has like this teal color, this pretty gray, kind of like a yellowy, and then like a really nude white color. There's the yellow and there's the white color. And now I'm going to show you some drugstore finds that I think are really cool. Everybody asked me to do something with the color tattoo eyeshadow from Maybelline. And the color that I just love, I think this is so, so, so gorgeous. This is Tough as Taupe. It's just like a really taupey kind of gray color. And what I do is I would just take it on my finger and then I just apply it to the eye. See, you can see it's kind of a really pretty taupey color. I put it on today as a base color and then I build color on top of it. So this... This, um, what is this called? Tough as taupe. This is beautiful. And there was only like a couple of these left, so apparently everybody else likes these too. And then of course, you know me and turquoise. Um, this is tenacious teal. And I'm just going to show you. You can apply it like with your finger, but I suggest using a little brush. This is just a lip brush. And then you can just kind of paint it on precisely where you want it. So you could do a winged liner. Look at this turquoise color. It's amazing. Tenacious teal. I love this. 
Um, so these get my stamp of awesomeness on them. Another one that I'm really, really loving is the um, L'Oreal the Voluminous Smoldering Eyeliner. Now this is in gray. I also have the one in black but it is like this beautiful sooty gray smoldery color in this little chubby pencil and the pigment is amazing in these. I really love these. So this is the gray and I also have the black and they come with a little sharpener. So I really am loving these two. Next I'm gonna show you a cool thing is, I, I already did a blog about this and if you guys don't read my blog, I mention a lot more things than I do in videos. Every day there's something new and cool and whatever. And so I do giveaways on there too that I don't do on YouTube because the YouTube giveaways are just getting too out of control. But I, I forgot to tell you another MAC item. Um, this is the MAC Lightful Collection and this is their Marine Bright Formula the Softening Lotion. It's just like a liquid you apply on your face. Now this has three different types of seaweed, which is really great for your skin. And this is their all natural, it's like a more natural collection of everything. And this is the Marine Bright Formula uh, Moisture Cream. And it just smells really clean and light and delightful. And I love that it's all natural and it has the seaweed and it doesn't have a lot of other like harsh chemicals ingredients. So I really love that. I'm gonna give this a test drive. I haven't tried it yet, but this is just what I got to try out. And then from NYX, if you suffer from oily skin and you're tired of shining and looking like you're blinding people with the glare off your face, it's time to get some blotting tissues, people. Now these are the NYX, um, NYX, whatever, however you like to call them. This is the green tea blotting paper, and then this is the tea tree. So you're going to tea tree any zips that you may have. I just said zips. I meant zits. So the cool thing about this that I'm going to show you is you take these little blotting tissues like this. And since there's tea tree oil, it helps kill bacteria and little blemishes. You just kind of press this down where you would be oily. And yep, there's little stuff that came off in my chin. And this is really cool to pop them in your purse to cancel out some of that shine on your face because nobody likes shine. Okay, next I'm gonna show you something fun for hair. You guys probably saw the video where I had like that blue streak in my hair. It wasn't hair chalking, although if you missed my hair chalking video, you should click it because it's really awesome. Um, but these are from Sultra, and you can curl these, you can wave them, you can flat iron, you can do anything because they're real hair. And they come in all different colors. There's like tangerine, cheetah print, pink, lapis blue, light pink, rich sable, ocean teal. I'm not sure what this one's name is. What is his name? But it's kind of like this red highlight color. So all you do is you just lift up a section of hair. Will totally not go with my like bumpy curly hair today. And you just snap it in place. And then you, I could have curled this. I could have crimped this. I could have done whatever. But these are from Sultra, and I love it because some of the cheaper ones just look like plastic doll hair, and these are like real, more real looking, and you can really style them. And you can, I think you can get these at Sephora. These are the. Okay, you guys know that the soft can. Candy Treat Lip Balm is like one of my favorite lip balms. It's one of my purse, by my bed, in my bathroom, everywhere because I love them. They came out in a new flavor which is coconut cream and they're all natural, organic, everything which is why I love them. This smells, I wish you could smell this through the camera, through the screen because this smells so good. I just want to, I don't know, I just want to bite it. I think I, uh, he may be moving up in my favorites but it's the coconut cream one. I love it. And um, I also got um, this is the, I love their name, the Butter Your Muffin Organic Aloe Anti-Cellulite Body Cream and help to firm and smooth the skin. Um, it's like body lotion. I just put it all over and it's from Treat too. It's all organic and it smells so good and clean. It smells like what I imagine when you go to fancy hotels or a fancy place and it just smells lovely like flowers and goodness. That's what it, that's what it smells like. It smells like fancy goodness. That's amazing. Oh, I also got a lip scrub from them. Oh, it's in my shower. Let me go get it and I'll show you because I love it. All right, I'm back from a little trip to my bathroom. <laughs> okay, this is the soft candy lip scrub with organic sugar. It's the vanilla buttercream. And I'm serious, it looks like frosting. Like I, you rub it on your lips. I do it in the shower because that way I can like do that. I wash my face, everything else. I wanted to eat this. It is so good. It tastes so stinking good. I just wanted to eat this whole little jar. But I was like, oh yeah, scrubs, they're all like. I put this on and after you scrubbed your lips, my lips were, they've been like super extra chap and dry lately. But this made my lips so soft. There was like this, just this supple softness that was amazing and made me really fall in love with using a lip scrub. Because before I'd be like, I don't need a lip scrub. Treat makes everything amazing and it's organic. Treat, I love you, Treat. I love everything you make. 
Now I'm gonna tell you guys about beauty goody things. Now if you guys have seen my palettes, these are the Z palettes. And again, I blogged about this. The cool thing about them, they're cardboard, they're magnetic. You can see through them, which I love. I hate other palettes, you can't see what's in there. So if you have a bunch, you're opening them all to see which one it is or anything. So I have, a, I have these in all different kinds. This is my blue and green palette with my leopard print. They came out with a new one and the new ones are a little bigger. So this is like their pro one. So it holds more and it's deeper. You get these little magnetic stickers. You can even get the empty, um, where they go? You can even get the empty pans to make your own lip gloss and stuff to put them inside. And the cool thing I wanna show you why it's bigger is you can fit brushes in there too. So if you're traveling, you can fit these. Now I'll show you side by side. Can you see the red one's a little thicker? And it's a little bit bigger, like it's taller this way. So this is their new, the Z palette, the extra larger, I don't know what it is, but it's their bigger one. And it also comes in the zebra, which I love the zebra. And Zena is super nice that came up with these. She works on Dancing with the Stars. She does the makeup and stuff on a bunch of other things too, but she designed these and she's super sweet and I just think she's great and I think her idea is brilliant. Oh, perfume. I know you guys cannot smell through here and I always love my vanilla, my Sud Pacific Vanilla Extreme. Um, I've worn it for years and I never really stray away from that, but this is kind of amazing and kind of worth straying away from. It's the Scent Gloss by Costume um, National, National, <laughs> and it smells, I mean you can't smell it, I'm going to just spray it on because it smells so good. Oh my gosh, I normally don't like perfumes at all, like on other people be like, oh, <laughs> I don't like that or that smells too musky or too oriental or too barbie or too bleh. so I'm really hard to find perfumes in this. Smells so delicious. It's in Scent Gloss. Scent Gloss by Costume National. And it's amazing. Amazing. The bottle is so pretty and I just love it. I don't know why I developed an accent. Maybe when you wear it you just smell fancy that you need an accent. I'm going to tell you about something really, really cool. This is a phone app that you can play with that I just got. It's called Modiface. Okay, it's doing something really ugly. I took a picture of my face, and it's like making sure it gets the points. Can you see that? There's a weird glare. Um, but you take a picture of yourself, and then you can try on different makeup on your face without really buying it. This is so cool. So it's called Modiface Makeup. It looks like M-O-D-I Face Makeup. So that's a really fun app. There's also another app they're working on for makeup artists or just to play around to do face charts online. And um, it's not out yet, but when it, if it does come out for sure, I will let you guys know because it's going to be really, really fun and cool. Now, on to my first Sure Off My Back giveaway. And I'm going to give away a nail polish too. So this Rolling Stones shirt, and it's, it's like a one size fits all. There's no size, so this will fit everybody. If you're skinny, it'll just be really baggy on you. And then it'll just... It, it's just a perfect, see how big, you can see how big it is. So it's got like sequins and um, I got it in Melrose and I just thought it'd be fun if you guys wanted to win this too. And to match, I'm going to give you guys from the shop um, and cook collection from MAC this nail polish which will kind of match the yellow and the yellow that I'm wearing. This is Alfredo, this yellow nail polish. So you will win both of those things. Now the thing is, the contest is not going to be here on YouTube. You do have to be a subscriber. Um, but go to the link below for the blog. Link is attached underneath this video on YouTube. And there will be the official rules and everything on how you can win when the contest is going to be. And I will pick people from all over the world. You can live anywhere and you can win this contest. I forgot to tell you about one of the most important things I was going to tell you about. Methylparaben. People ask me all the time, what is methylparaben and why is it bad to be in our uh, makeup ingredients? It's like an antifungal agent that basically makes your bacteria doesn't grow in anything from shampoos to moisturizer, sunscreen, everything. Um, but methylparaben has been actually known that when it mixes with um, UV rays, so what it does is it rapidly ages those cells, ages your face, so it's going to make you look wrinklier, which is funny because it's in a lot of ingredients like anti-aging products, which is really crazy. So, um, I mean, parabens have a lot of other dangerous reasons why they shouldn't be in there. If you want to find out about them, if you guys want me to do a longer blog about them, I will. But that's just one ingredient you want to make sure when you're looking at your products that you're avoiding those. And a lot of companies, um, Tarte is one of them. There's many other companies that go out of their way to make sure that they're not putting any kind of parabens in the cosmetics. So just read your labels, make sure there's no parabens and things. Oh, and one more thing I forgot to tell you about. MAC is doing something really cool. You have a chance to vote and bring back some of your favorite MAC colors. Now this is for super mac a lack -a ding dong fans that have been fans of MAC for a long time like 10 years or more because some of the colors are from like 2009 which I love because I was still buying stuff there and what I voted for was Moxie and probably a lot of you guys don't know Moxie 
It was like such a favorite color of mine. I had I went to the Mac store before they stopped selling it and had them scrape me the leftovers in a little jar so I could keep it in color match and like mix my own to match that color. Moxie is amazing. It's like probably the color of this couch but a little darker and it's matte. It's like the same formula that Ruby Woo is made out of. So there's like, I believe that's the one with the clay in it. So it's a really matte color and they don't make a lot of those like that. So I vote for Moxie to come back. You will love it, I promise you. And then the other color I voted for lip gloss. It's like a neutral pink. It's like 3N or 2N, I can't remember. That's an older one. And then Moth Brown is super old. I vote for like the old school ones because they don't have these colors. Moth Brown is amazing. So go to the MAC Facebook page and you can vote. You can vote like every day. And I voted for those. I voted for Moxie, the 2N or 3N, and the Moth Brown because they're amazing. So if you want to see those again, you will love them. I love that Moxie. I, I think I still have that jar somewhere like just to save and stare at the color. I didn't put it on because that's gross, but make sure you check out that too. Okay, guys. I hope you had an awesome day. I hope you liked the video. Comment below if you have anything you want to tell me. And thank you for leaving me nice and awesome comments. I love them. And we will see you in the next video. Okay, <laughs> bye.